solid majority, except it wasn't quite two-thirds. So we're going to have to get back at them again. I'm stubborn, and uh, we're going to get that. It's the only way to ever really get this runaway spending under control. The people of this country want it. It takes a long time for the word to reach Washington sometimes. This is a different world, and every once in a while you have to get out. I think I'm due to get on a trip down to Florida. Uh, pretty soon, I think. We hope so. Discussion yeah, right. schedule, and uh, I look forward to it. You have to get out in the real world every once in a while, and then come back here. It's like going into a decompression chamber. <laughs> <laughs> Incidentally, while I'm talking, Henry, I know that your daughter in law, Nancy, is very involved in doing great work in the Junior League in uh, drug addiction. With the help of Mrs. Reagan. And I know another Nancy. <laughs> that is doing <laughs> some work also in that. But again, we're delighted to have you here. And now, Mr. President, excuse me, I saw in the morning's paper a UPI article that said, quoting your press secretary, saying that uh, if the people wanted you to run in 1984, that probably you would. And I think we ought to take a little poll right here now. Would you all like to see him run? <laughs> Florida, we want to extend you right now the invitation to come to Florida on April the 15th, 1992, to cut the ribbon opening the World's Fair in the fifth, uh, 500th anniversary of Columbus discovering America. And we want to point out he didn't discover it in Chicago. <laughs> See if we let me go. <laughs> 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 
that's the one thing I found out about this job. One day before I get out of here, I'm going to find where those decisions are made. And that paper that greets me every day that tells me what I'm going to be doing every 15 minutes for the rest of the day. I, uh, every once in a while, it's a little embarrassing. Someone visits Washington like you have, and they tell me, say, we're looking forward to seeing you when they give me the date in their town. And I say, you are? <laughs> I am. <laughs> That's the first I've heard of it. But, uh, but it was all set, and they were right. So we'll just trust that you're right, too. All right. Well, anyway, I would like now, because Nancy and I are going to step aside, and uh, I want to present to you my chief counselor here, Ed Meese who's going to be speaking to you uh, on some things here that might be of interest to you that affect your lives and are going on in Washington. Is that the general subject, Ed? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Ed, please.